uh, certainly the 16 days of activism is important for us and specifically as the Uganda Women's Parliamentary Association because we use this day to call on government to do what it is supposed to do. As parliament, we do enact laws, laws that are intended to end gender-based violence, but the implementation and enforcement of these laws remains a challenge. So we use this um, annually to call on government, see the gaps that exist first of all, and then call on government to ensure that some of those issues that have not been addressed are addressed. It's unfortunate that um, uh, violence against women and girls still continues and actually is increasing in number because we are seeing the trafficking of, of girls from different parts of the country. The sex, the sex slave coming back, it's there. We've seen cases even in court. And the biggest hurdle that I have seen as government, there are no shelters where these people can now run to. So that is a problem because where does this person go to? You can't be in the community where your tormentor, the person who led you into this, is. So you need to be away from the community. So that remains a challenge. We need to call upon government to allocate resources so that at least in every region, there is this shelter where these girls and women, or even men, can be in the meantime before they actually, uh, their cases are disposed of. My key message is that this dealing with issues or ending violence against women and girls cannot be achieved by the women alone. We need the men on board to appreciate women as God's creation and as equal partners in the development of this country. No nation can develop if it ignores the women. So let's move together and end this violence and appreciate one another as equal partners in our country and in development.